let's take a look at systemic study. Whether you're explicitly thought about it before or not, you've been reading people almost all of your life by watching their actions and interpreting what you see, or by trying to predict what people might do under different conditions. The casual approach to reading others can often lead to erroneous predictions. Underlying the systemic approach in this course is the belief that behavior is not random. Rather, we can identify fundamental consistencies underlining the behavior of all individuals and modify them to reflect individual differences. These fundamental characteristics are very important because they allow predictability. Behavior is generally predictable, and the systemic study of behavior is a way to make reasonably accurate predictions. Systematic study means looking at relationships, causes and effects, and basing our conclusions on evidence. Evidence-based management complements systemic study by basing managerial decisions on the best available scientific evidence. A manager might pose a question, search for the best available evidence, and apply the relevant information to the question or case in hand. Most manager decisions are not made this way. Systematic study and EBM add to intuition or those gut feelings about what makes others tick. Of course, the things you've come to believe in an unsystematic way are not necessarily incorrect. Relying on intuition is made worse because we tend to overestimate the accuracy of what we think we know. Surveys of human resource managers have also shown that many managers hold so-called common sense opinions regarding effective management that have been flatly refuted by empirical evidence. We find a similar problem in chasing the business and popular media for management wisdom. The business press tends today to be dominated by fads.